Windows is by far the most popular desktop operating system. It being on about 90% of all PCs in the world. With just like any operating system, it needs updates. So what could Microsoft call the next version of Windows? Well, they have a few options, so let's explore those options right now. All right, the first option is Windows 9. Now, this is the most obvious choice. This is what everybody's calling it. This is what I've been calling it, just as referring to it as Windows 9. Just everybody kind of knows that's the next version of Windows when somebody says Windows 9. And it does make a lot of sense going from Windows 7 to 8 to Windows 9. Microsoft wanted to do a rapid release cycle with Windows 8, which just means that about every year there's a .1 update come out. So you can see how they started to do that with Windows 8.1, and they plan on doing that year after year after year. Uh, it's what Apple does with OS 10, where they put out a new version of Mac OS 10 every year. Uh, but they could do it with Windows 9 instead, and it would sound good. Windows 9.1, Windows 9.2. The next option they have is Windows 8.2. Now, there are a few issues with this. Number one, according to the screenshot that they did officially announce and show at Microsoft Build 2014, the start menu is coming back. And they specifically said that. So, if they called it Windows 8.2, that wouldn't make much sense because the whole thing of Windows 8 is start screen. And to call it 8.2 implies a start screen and no start menu. Plus all the negative publicity that Microsoft has gotten with Windows 8 and Windows 8.1. Microsoft, like if they called it Windows 8.1, people wouldn't want to look at it because they hear all these bad things about Windows 8. But if they called it like Windows 9, they'd be like, ooh, look at the new version of Windows. I better check it out. A third option they have is naming it after the year of release. And they actually did this in the 90s with Windows 95, released in 1995. Windows 98, released in 1998, and Windows 2000 being released in 2000. Now, this would be Windows 15 because every, every, every single source on the internet is saying that this version of Windows is projected to be released in early 2015, so like in the spring. So we're actually coming up on this release pretty soon here in just a few months. So while I was doing some research on this, I thought of my own... Uh, name for Windows, one that they could use, you know, not one of the more obvious ones. And this might be published by somebody else somewhere. It might be somebody else's idea, but I did. I didn't read it somewhere. You know, I, I thought of it on my own. Windows 1. Now, when I say 1, I don't mean the number 1. I mean written out the O-N-E, Windows 1. The reason behind me thinking of this is last July, the CEO of Microsoft at the time, Steve Ballmer, announced Microsoft's vision for one Microsoft. And they're kind of doing that one thing with the Xbox One, Microsoft OneDrive, so why not Windows One? Well, I was thinking, and here's why not Windows One. Uh, it would get kind of confusing. First of all, because Microsoft had Windows 1.0 in 1985 as the first version of Windows. It would be really confusing for consumers to say, I use Windows 1. Uh, do you mean the first version of Windows ever or the brand new one? And it would kind of, it would just cause a lot of confusion saying Windows 1. You know, I know when I say or hear Windows 1, I, I think instantly the first version of Windows. And second of all, if they were to call it Windows 1, that wouldn't be very good with the point one updates that Microsoft, seem, I assume, still wants to do. Could you imagine Windows 1.1, Windows 1.2? That it doesn't. That makes it even more confusing because when you say point one, that kind of sounds like something that we written in numerals, like it was in the 80s. So the final option Microsoft has, at least that I can see as far as all my research goes and my thinking behind how Microsoft could do this, is using a code name. Microsoft always has and still does use code names for their beta versions. So when, pro when versions of Windows are in development, they use code names. For example, Windows 95 was known as Chicago when it was in its development cycle. Windows 98 was Memphis. Windows XP was Whistler. Windows Vista was Longhorn. Windows 8.1 was had the codename of Blue, Windows Blue. That's what everybody was calling it before it came out, 
and that was they were referring it to Windows Blue. So what's stopping Microsoft from saying, you know what, we don't want to have to deal with the numbers and stuff. Let's just go back to code names. And they actually did use code names. I say code names because that's really what it is. It's instead of using some sort of number that signifies its release. Here's the thing about code names. Like I said, they still use code names and they always have and they always will use code names in their beta versions when they're developing an operating system. And we are no, we as the public know about Project Threshold from Microsoft. And we don't know much about it. In fact, pretty much all we know is that it exists and that it is scheduled to be completed very soon. And these, can, these facts, we are drawing conclusions that this could be Windows 9 or Windows 15 or Windows 1 or Windows, you know, code name. You know whatever whatever it is there are lots of theories a lot of people believe that project threshold is the next version of windows and it could be but it could also be something completely different if it is the next version of windows microsoft could very easily say you know what we're just going to market it as windows threshold and just sell it but anyway guys that's the video thank you so much for watching Check out the links in the corners of your screen and don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Link is below my video right here, below my body, right there. And I'm Joe Green. I thank you so much for watching. I will see you on Thursday. Like, ooh, look at the new version of Windows. I better check it out. Windows 8.1 among developers. No, no, blah, 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 blah. Like, ooh, look at the new version of Windows. I better check it out. Like, ooh, look at the new version of Windows. I better check it out. Like, ooh, look at the new version of Windows. I better check it out.